So there's, I don't know if you guys ever seen that feelings kit that we have. It's six essential oils that are just created. And for us to create simplicity and um, just really being able to be grounded and present and allowing us to, who we are to be at our core being. Um, so the first oil is valor. So valor to me means courage, it's grounding. I would always apply this oil to my wrists before presenting and just to be present and grounded with myself. Um, and I know sometimes we don't have that. Grounding is another really great oil to, to substitute or highest potential. So just apply that oil, so use Valor, and apply it to your feet, and that's the first step. And then, so the second step. Harmony um, is basically a, a beautiful essential oil, and it's, I, when I read the word harmony, and I, well, that's what I love about Young Living, is they really thought their oils out in the verbiage that goes with each essential oils, and harmony that comes to my mind is peace to be within and it's an energy point. So an energy point is our body is all energy. So it could be anywhere that you need to feel it. It could be your heart, could be your your um, third eye, it could be your crown which is on the top of your um, head. It could be at the bottom of your feet because you really want to be in peace. Just really trust working with the essential oils from Young Living because they truly do what they're supposed to do. That's awesome. So the next one is forgiveness. So I created a special slide just for the oil of forgiveness. This is like amazing. If you had one oil, I don't know, I, I definitely can use more forgiveness in my life. <laughs> um, so I'm going to work through just a process. One of the spaces that you can put it, this isn't written in stone. You have to apply it to your navel area. It's a good place to start where, yeah. you know, that's where we were first given life. We were, we come into this world being fed through the umbilical cord and through the navel area. So that's where we hold a lot, we can be holding a lot of emotion there. Um, so there's like five steps in this forgiveness process. Um, and as you're reading this, you might have some emotional triggers just in terms of what's coming up for you. 